Burning Tide Productions presents. Hi, it is I, Burning Kai, and welcome to a vlog. Now, in today's vlog, I'm just gonna be walking around this mall with little Timmy. Yeah, Malcolm, show them Malcolm. He's, he's granted me permission to watch his son for however long we're in this store. And uh, we're just gonna walk around and introduce Timmy to people. See how many people walk up and ask about Timmy. Let's go. This is the first time I saw what I looked like. <laughs> <laughs> People's faces is enough to make me laugh. <laughs> me too. Point of finger broke off again. Ah, I need to go get. We need to go get super glue now. Doctor, can't feel little Timmy's pulse. Someone call a doctor. My friend needs medical attention. It's okay, Timmy. It'll be fine. Someone call a doctor. Timmy's in danger. Excuse me. He's a doctor. My friend is very sick. He needs a doctor. He needs medical attention right now. Right on. He's dying. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, is that pelvis Presley? <laughs>
the original pretzel nuggets, and my little friend here will like a Sprite. Uh, he needs a straw. He, he has trouble with his mouth buttering. Oh, okay, thank you. Can they is that it? That's that's a I just realized I'm showing your card off to the my camera. Tip. If you wanna drink this, you gotta put the straw in your mouth. But he doesn't have lips. You can't hold it. Bite it. Put the straw in your mouth. It's a, uh, why do I have to work with a child? I should have brought Malcolm instead. No offense. There we go. Much better. He's a professional moon Show us. Oh, moon slider. I bet this was an accident, but when I was doing this, his legs I love how no matter what I do, you always cross your legs whenever I pick you up. You were quite the sophisticated young man when you were alive, weren't you? No. Oh my gosh, I can't believe how skinny you are. How do you do that? You gonna answer my question or what? Malcolm, you need to raise your son better. So, <clears throat> while we were walking around the mall, little Timmy's hand decided to go run away. And when it ran away, its pointer finger broke off. I got it right here, don't worry, I didn't lose it. But um, now we need to go make a stop at the hospital and get a splint. Hopefully it's not too late. Hopefully he can get it reattached. If not, we'll have to go stop at like Hobby Lobby or something, go get glue. So, um... The hospital said they don't perform s surgeries on people who are already dead. I mean, I don't know what they're talking about. He's very alive for a skeleton. I felt I had to cover his ears and everything. This poor, poor boy. Skeletons have feelings too. Don't forget that. So yeah, um, we decided to go to Walmart so then we can go pick up some super glue for his finger. Oh yeah, also um, while we were driving, his mi middle finger broke as well. Um, fun fact about little Timmy and Malcolm, when I got them, little Timmy came with his pointer finger broken off and his middle finger hanging on by just a thread. So now he's back at that. I did all that work for nothing. <laughs> I spent hours trying to super glue his fingers back together because I have really shaky hands. I couldn't hold still and just glue his finger on. I, I, it was just a nightmare. Now I gotta do all that again. Mm. Maybe the cameraman can do it. Anyway, yeah. Little Timmy's gonna pick out the um, the glue brand. I told him he could. He's gonna go pick it out. So, let's go. I think I know the person in that car. Or the person in the passenger seat. Hey, 
having a dead child is way better than having a real one. They do everything you tell them to. Come on, Timmy, let's go. Look at Timmy, does he need to go pee or something? Like, why is, he, why is he doing this with his legs? I hate how fast I was able to get into that position. What's little Timmy's favorite food? Bone broth. He's a cannibal, just like his father. He also likes, um, he likes a good dog bone too. If you got like spare chicken bones after you're done eating chicken leg or something, just throw it at Timmy, he'll eat it. Skinless chicken bones? <laughs> yeah, meatless chicken bones. He hates it when you buy boneless chicken though. One for one reason it's an insult to his kind. The second reason is because, well, like I said, he likes to eat the bones. Malcolm isn't as much of a cannibal as his son though. Malcolm really only ever likes to eat bone broth and dog bones on occasion whenever he's feeling like it but no he normally eats like human food like um meat meat i've never seen a walmart with this much empty space in it before These were the stoking wouldn't leave on top so you didn't have a nuts. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good joke. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I'm surprised you even have those out of the sun. Because they don't have nuts. I'm scared to touch them. No, he brought it with him. Oh, he did? Oh. Yeah. oh, no, 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 no. Don't tell him a lie. I, I dug this out of the backyard. He won't sit still. He won't sit still. Come on. It's part of the body of Napoleon bone apart. <laughs> That's a good joke. That one, that was good. That was good. He's tired. I think he wants to be grass <laughs> It's time to nurse. It's time to nurse. Crash. Are you okay, Timmy? He's not speaking. I think we need to go get medical attention. Again? Yeah, again. Timmy, speak to me, Timmy. Timmy! Oh. All right, climb in there, I'll get you. <laughs> 